Hi, hello. My name is Kat, and this is Whittier Stitches. Welcome to Floss Tube 11. Yes. Um, today we're doing a beginning of the year, 2024, January, whatever, whip parade. Um, I wasn't originally going to do one because <laughs> I haven't worked on anything in a while. Um, but I thought it would have fun. I thought it would be fun to have this to look at next year come January. So we're gonna do it anyways. Um, I've been stitching monogamously on a project for a little over a month and I can't show that project yet. So, um, well I do have, well, I guess not completely monogamously. I did have another project that I stitched on for two days while I was out of town. I got some project progress um, but anyways so we're gonna start with oldest to newest um, I may not have all the information so if I'm missing anything I will pop it on the screen um, so we'll, let's jump right on in oldest whip mom's house Started this October 17th, 2022. Um, this is artwork I had commissioned on Fiverr from Taraj Renuka. Um, and then I made a few small edits to it because my mom kept changing her house. Um, <laughs> and then turned it into a cross stitch pattern. And here we go. Ta-da. This is at like 12 something percent. Um, it is huge. It's massive. It's 300 by 500 and I don't know what I was thinking because uh, I was definitely a new baby to big projects. Okay. Apparently the neighbor's dogs are out and my dogs are losing their ever-loving mind. Guys. Quit. <sighs> okay. Second project started November 21st, 2022. This is... Midsummer Night's Fairy by Mirabilia. Um, no clue how far along I am, but she's there. I fudged a lot of it. I got tired of fudging it, so I gritted it. She's doing better now. Um, where's she at? There we go. <laughs> I'm so coordinated, I know. Oh my goodness. Kathleen, what do you have? Today's just going to be a video full of dog interruptions. Oh goodness. Um, okay, here we go. This one was December 8th, 2022. This is the Sim Sampler. It originally ran as a cell. It is made by me. I hosted the sale. Did not finish my own project. No surprise there. Um, it's almost done. I'll finish it eventually. It's a good thing I haven't put a year on this one. <laughs> there are some other ones I might have already put a year on. <clears throat> December 16th, 2022. And this one is a wrinkly mess. Um, this is... The Dark Queen of the Earth. Um, I just, I lost steam. Um, she's gorgeous. I love her. She'd be beautiful when she's done. But I really got tired of stitching background. Um, I hate background. I would, I don't, I've learned I would rather just stitch the person and leave all of the background out. Um, that is on the under the Sea Fabrics 32 count nightshade linen um, that was special dyed for that sale. And that's by Autumn Lane Stitchery. Um, this is the Steady Threads 2023 20, Blackwork sale that I very obviously did not keep up with. Um, this is hand dyed by me on just some Charles Craft 16 count Ada. Um, this one I did put a year on like a goober. So at the bottom, 
down there. I'll put whatever year I finish it in, <laughs> I guess. That'll be my tale of procrastination. Right, then big time jump. This is September 2023. The Uncanny Kari Arcana Sal on 18 count fiddler's cloth being stitched with Anchor Black and DMC 336. Um, woefully behind on. I believe they're up to like tarot card 13 now, and I've done through three. <laughs> So I'm 10 releases behind, is what it is. I've been focusing on other things. Um, October 15th, 2023, and this is Whip It Good from Heartstring Samplery. This was supposed to be a sow with Abby Ann Stitches, Boogie Stitcher, and Sally Ann Crafting. And then they kept selling it and I quit working on it because I started candy. Um, when I finished candy, I fully intend to pick this back up and keep going. This is um, Died By Me, 16 Count Charles Craft Ada, being stitched with Mo's Sales Silk and the color Scream. Um, beautiful combination. This is not picking up the right color fabric, but whatever. All right, here we go. This one was an adventure to even get started. Okay, this is Gaia by Bella Filipina on 14 count Charles Craft Ada, 100% cotton that I dyed myself. See the fabric, isn't it gorgeous? Okay, excuse my dog and her reverse sneezes. So that is as far as I am. This was a start with Cam the Stitcher. Um, because we both had it on our wish list, so I bought it for both of us for her birthday. Um, because I will like that. But yeah, so there's those. Uh, da -da -da -da. That was October 20th, 2023. Okay, Love Thy Neighbor by Modern Folk Embroidery. This is on Garibaldi's Needleworks, Alyssum 28 Count Monaco. Start this October 20th, 2023. Um, and this is actually a recharted. I changed it to say Love Thyself instead of Love Thy Neighbor. And I am doing with this with Jordan from Jordan at Needlehouse. Um, and it's super cute. And I love it. And I, again, plan on starting working on this again here soon. Uh, this is being stitched with Most Sales Silk Byzantium. This is a Crazy Hamster 14 Count Ada. Um, I don't think she names her Adas or her dyes, fabrics, whatever. And this is Love Bites. It is a Peccadillo by Long Dog Samplers. Um, I started this October 29th, 2023, and it's being stitched with Most Sales Silk Witch. Very cute. This is the only one that has had progress since the last time y'all have seen it. This is Quaternion Creations of Dragon and Apples. Ta-da! This is just some um, uh, 18 count Kadu Amazon Ada. Um, oh, my nose. Sorry, guys. Started this November 1st. This was part of my New Start Novembers, which I think the rest of these are all from New Start November. Either way, November 1st, Most Sales Silk and um, Dark Ruby and Tyrion, which are these colors, and then just DMC 310. Gorgeous. This is the Pixel Dragon Adventure Sal from Flossy Fox Shop. I adore everything Flossy Fox Shop. Um, and this is no exception. 
This was started November 2nd and, and is on Millennial Fabrics 18 Count Ada in the color Hemlock uh, with all the called for DMCs. And that's a sow and they're on like part three and I haven't even finished part one. <laughs> Next up is Gamer Skills Foraging from Flossy Fox Shop on um, Charles Craft 14 Count Ada. And I started this November 5th, called Four Colors. Stardew Valley Chris, no, I think they call it Winter. Stardew Valley Winter by Glitch Stitch AU, um, 18 Count KDU Ada, um, called Four, <laughs> yeah, the called Four. Uh, this was November 6th. This was my birthday start. Uh, but it was all part of New Start November, which was me celebrating my birthday the whole month long. Um, this one is the Christmas Eve book number 158 from the Prairie Schoolers. Stitched on picture this plus 16 count Heartland Ada. And... That's the picture of that, and I am down in this little corner down here. Um, yeah, ta-da, ta-da. <laughs> this one was a birthday present from um, the older of the two. Seeing this one we have is the Galaxy D20. I don't remember who it's by. Um, but yes, Galaxy D20 in the works on some printed Zweigart Ada. I think it's called, it's vintage something or another. I don't, don't really know. Um, I'm not even totally sure that it's the vintage part is correct. That's just what someone told me because I had no clue what it was. Um, all right, and then we have, I have no clue what day I started that one. I've got it written down somewhere, but I don't have a project card and same for this one. No clue what day I started it on. Um, but I do know it was in this order. So this is Evening Stroll from Autumn Laden Stitchery. This come in the Cassandra's Bewitching Box of Mystery. Um, and that's as far as I have gotten. Ah! Um, but yeah, it comes with everything you need to, to finish it. And I've barely started it. Um, let's see, what else? That's it, that's all my, that's all my whips. How many is that? I didn't count. Let me let me count. That's a good count. Oh. One, two. Three. Yeah, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I'm stuff. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Is that right? Sixteen. Um, <clears throat> and I have candy. That I can't show you, but she should also be done today. Um, she would be 17. And then I UFO'd Meg the Moth Woman because I just couldn't handle the fabric. Um, I'm going to frog what little bit's done on there, and then I will just give the fabric to someone that can handle stitching on such a high count um, because that's not me. I can't handle it. Um, so I need to find another fabric to do Meg the Moth Woman on. That's it for my whip parade. Yay! I'm done. You, can you see? Can you see? Look, I have a new collection of books. Not, I said books. Games. I got a gift card for my birthday. 
and I went wild at the the boardroom Tyler I had a blast um yeah okay that's it love you guys bye